Welcome to the eBakery YouTube channel, the agency for online merchants. 12 years ago we were introduced to eBay's best matching search algorithm and 6 years later to a patent called Methods and Systems for Deriving a Score with which item listings are ordered when presented in the search results. We are talking about Cassini. In this video we refer to an article written by Mark Steyer to explain how the search engine functions based on this patent. Every search you make on eBay gives you a list of products that are ranked depending on different scores. The most important ones are relevant score, business score and quality score. We can find out what each of them means from an excerpt of the US patent. As you can see the best match score is composed by these three important components relevance, listing quality and business rule. According to the graph we see that relevant score derives from the probability of a placed order and therefore a transaction if the results unfolded a certain way. In summary the score shows how likely it is to see an order being placed if product X was to rank high for a certain keyword. That's why the score has been given this name. It's about the relevance of a product for the given keyword. Let's skip the listing quality for a moment to take a look at the business rules. This result represents a promotion or demotion factor determined based on the evaluation of one or more business rules. It also includes seller data that is used for rank correlation along with the optimization of listings. For the listing quality which is about typical parameters such as the number of views, number of transactions, prices, shipping costs and how long the listing has been online, Mark Steyer offers an interesting graph that illustrates why sometimes it makes sense to delete a listing that is active for a long time and publish it again. We already have a reference about this in another video, link is on the top right of your screen. Here we see a formula that consists of three parameters, the predicted listing score, the observed listing score and the time-based parameter called weight. This parameter changes over time and has a range from 0 to 1. The value is 0 once an eBay listing has been published. Then the listing quality score is composed of the price, condition, shipping methods etc. The longer the listing is online, the higher the weight value gets. If it reaches 1, then the predicted listing score gets multiplied by 0, which gives a result of 0 again. In this case, the entire listing quality score is based only on the observed listing score. If there's no transactions or clicks on a listing, then its rank is dropping. That's why it sometimes makes sense to delete listings that aren't selling and set them up again. Now you understand to some extent how the Cassini algorithm is composed. Of course, there will be some more changes in the future that could for example be based on the personalization of the results. That means that person A can get a somewhat different result from person B, even though they both type the same keywords. If you want to learn more about that, you can find an article in the description. However, the basic concept of the US patent remains the same. That's why it's worth it to take the time to understand how it works and then use it for your eBay strategy. With that said, give us a like and subscribe to get more videos on complex subjects in the future. Your eBakery team.